Okay, back with another episode of The Mandalorian, Season 1, Episode 5. Come on, mate. I hope this starts picking it up a bit. <sighs> okay, here we go. Come on, give me, give me something. Give me something. Give me something than a few cool-looking visuals. Come on. Come on. Come on, Mandalorian. All right, come on. I can bring you in warm, or I can bring you in cold. Oh. I think this Mandalorian title music's cool, but come on. Chapter 5, The Gunslinger. Okay. Now he has to land somewhere and fix his ship and get in and help the population. This is the modern version of the Kung Fu show, isn't it? Where's, uh, what, what's he, what was his name in Kung Fu? Oh, this is Moss Eisley Tower. Oh, Moss Eisley, hey? This is a uh, fan service. Um, yes, come right in. Oh, we're gonna get a lot of fan service here. Gonna get a lot of fan service here. Ah, oh, and it begins. Let's look at your ship. You. you don't have to say it twice. She's good. Oh, lady. Womp rat. Oh, Womp rat. Sometimes it's painful. You'd think the galaxy would be bigger, wouldn't you? What do you think, Sam? Do you think the galaxy would be bigger than, than how it's portrayed in this? Oh my god. Three bolts. Helen, take a good look at you. Oh, this music. The music tells me what to feel. Like, if they played really scary, suspenseful music, we'd be thinking, oh no, she's gonna kill it. Would you like some food? The Mandalorian gets back. It gets, and then, the droid will get some little gross thing and bring it back, and it'll love it. For watching you. So she's not ripping him off. She should charge him extra. Shouldn't she, Sam? She wouldn't charge extra to look after Sam. She would pay to look after you, wouldn't she? Wouldn't she? Oh man. Have a seat, my friend. Gee, for a minute Name's there. Toro. Toro Calican. Oh wow, you look rugged. Yeah, this guy talked to you, you'd be like, mate, who are you? You're a little boy. Now the positional data suggests she's headed out beyond the Dune Sea. Dude, you'd stop trying job. so hard. How long you been with the guild? Long enough. You're Clearly right. Not. If you go after her, you won't make it past sunrise. If you go after anything, this you won't. This is my first job. No, okay, good. You... What is with the Mandalorian? Yeah, three, five and half an hour. Looks like you're stuck with me now, partner. Then you just say, "No, I'm not." Piss off. Stuck with you? We didn't sign anything. Like, are other people experiencing this pain as well? Or is it just me? Where is he? Quiet! Oh, it's okay. Do you have any idea how long it took me to get it to sleep? Give him to me. Not so fast. You can't just leave. The acting. Anyway, I started the acting. a fuel leak. This is, he reminds me of, um, Thor's brother. What'd you expect? Not Loki, the actor Thor. <laughs> From Hunger Games. It reminds me a bit of him. Chris Hemsworth, Liam Hemsworth, that's his name. 
When I was a when I was a little kid, I had a toy speeder bike, and I loved it so much. It had a button on the back you press, and it would like blow up when you press it, and it was so fun. You put it together and go around and go and blow it up. Oh man, I got so much pleasure out of that little speeder boy. What is it, sand people? God. Sam people. Tuscan Raiders. I heard the locals talking about that they best keep their distance. Yeah? Or what? Why don't you tell them yourself? They can teleport. Quick, get that other girl to teleport behind them. What are you... I don't know if that's like their on? faces or if they're masks or what. Are oh, they masks, aren't they? Let me see the Binox. Why? The Binox, eh? Just give him the Binox. Hey, what? All right, tell me what you see. I you see bet. that CGI the thing that, that they back. put in the first Star Wars movie to fuck it up. Is that her? Is that the target? That would suck, having to be filmed running in the sand. You just can't run in sand and look cool in shoes. It's not possible. No, is my talking disturbing you, Sam? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm disturbing you. It's a trap. No, it's not. He said cover him. He said cover him. Come on, rounds down range. Start shooting. Only an MK modified rifle could make that shot. Are you alright? In all the galaxy, yeah. that's the only rifle that can make that car. shot, is it? Wow. With that range. You see where that shot came from? Yeah, it came from that ridge. Still dark. Then why didn't well, you start you shooting at that She's ridge while I was ground. running up the hill, you fucking idiot? Over. The sniper would have. The sniper could have taken them out easily. Oh, wow. Sam, it's an attractive woman. Wow. Sons are down. Time to ride, Mando. Not an ordinary looking person, an attractive person. Come on. Sleep on the job, old man. Get away from my spare set of armor. Shouldn't it in real life he'd have gone That's like, hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. She'll snipe us right <coughs> off the And place. he'd just go, Doosh! and just blow him away, and he'll be lying it's there going, uh, I was only joking! Shots. And the other guy, Mandalorian, would just say, well, you're a fucking idiot then. Combine that with our speed and we got Gonna a point a gun at a Mandalorian chance. as a joke. Hey, you wanted this. That was a good move. That was a good move, shooting a f like a flare or a flashbang sort of thing. No. Fuck up thermal imagery. That'd be good if she'd just moved on. If she'd just left and then just flying across there going, just shooting flares in the sky and there's just nobody there. Not so fast, Fennec. Wow, they're really good at this teleporting move. Come on, you can. Sh if she's this badass and she's a killer, everything. You can show him punching her in the face, can't you? No, I can just throw her around and stuff. This show is just going to be heaps of people teleporting, like straight to where they need to be. Why don't you have the other guy cuff her? Oh, maybe not. It's been a long time since I've one seen of one of your kind. That's racist! You're my ticket into the guild. You're welcome. Just tell everyone, buddy. Hmm. I wonder what's gonna happen. I reckon she's gonna overpower him. Get free of the handcuffs and bugger off and the Mandalorian will catch her. Quiet. Quiet or what? No, he looks a bit what? like that guy from 127 hours. His armor alone's worth more than my bounty. Whatever that guy's name is. I just be like, eh, 
that sounds like too much work. I've already got this job wrapped up. I'm good. Cheers. Cheers, baby. Don't let her get that ghost. What did he shoot her? That's though? good advice. Oh, that was good. I but like if I that. Took those oh, did he kill her? Okay, I've been knocking this shit the whole time. Okay, that was cool. That was good. That was awesome. Wasn't she dead or alive? I'll just say she attacked me, I killed her. Why did he piss off? Fucking droids. You're smarter than you look. Santa Cruz right. Shut up, lady. I don't know, he's not that hard to catch. Doo -doo. That guy was an idiot. Everybody's an back. idiot. We gotta get it. Where is it? Is he floating in the air somewhere? Here I am, everybody. Here I am. You are. Hello. Huh. Are you hiding Hello. from us? Huh? I'm a little Look puppet. No, not Pikachu. No, it's not really Pikachu. I know she didn't friend. say that. All right, pig droids. Let's drag this out of here. Let's drag this out of here. We're dragging the Beggar's Canyon. Beggar's Canyon. Almost Beggar's Canyon. It sounds like a place in Red Dead Redemption. Another one, another adventure down. Oh, still going. Ready for some annoying shit. What? Okay, well, there's another episode of Kung Fu in Space down. Man, I'm struggling with this show a bit. It just, it just seems so many cliche after cliche after cliche. Fan service, cliche, fan service, cliche. Old Kung Fu episodes, old Star Trek episodes. Like, I'm just not seeing anything original in this at all. And I just saw before in the cast, it said Nick Nolte. Who's Nick Nolte? Because I love me some Nick Nolte. So where's, where's he at? Unless have I just been paying zero attention. Because I watched some YouTube videos that were saying you've got to be yourself when you make videos and I was thinking, oh, if I wasn't enjoying the show, should I still be going, oh, wow, cool, look, hey, look, it's those droids from The Phantom Menace. Wow, oh, that not that cool? And I'm like, man, I can't do that. I just have to go, man, that sucks. I mean, you've got the whole galaxy, the whole universe of imagination you can use. Just look at a Rick and Morty cartoon. And these guys are just rehashing the same old stuff. Sorry if you like this show, but, man, it's just, I'm just not feeling it. And that end, was that the cliffhanger ending? Some guy walked up. Okay, cool. Yeah, his footsteps and he had a cloak, it looked like. It sounded like he was another Mandalorian. Oh, no, another fucking faceless person's coming. This Mandalorian is not professional at all. Um, I don't know how he got it even into the guild of bounty hunters. He probably went to shoot his very first bounty. There was a space drug dealer and he probably got all scared and merciful and went, no, even he deserves to live. Probably saved him. Who knows? But okay, well, that's another episode down. Glad you could join me. Sorry if um you're just hearing me bag on your favourite thing in the world, but uh oh, man. It's boring as hell.